Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is Glacier Kennedy today to play some more Mario Kart 8 because another DLC came out, as you can possibly tell here, as there is Dry Bowser. This is the one that has all of the, you know, Animal Crossing stuff. Let's go back to the character select screen. Because, I mean, Dry Bowser is amazing. And he is the main reason that I care about the pack, but, you know, they have Cat Peach, fairly standard, as well as Villager, which you can also change over to the female version if you want. It's pretty nice. And then there's this weird dog thing that everybody apparently loves that I don't really know about because she's only in Animal Crossing New Leaf and I haven't played that yet because I'm a terrible person and, you know, I own the game though, but I just haven't played it yet. I haven't gotten around to it, but still, there's this new vehicle that looks amazing that I'm going to have to be trying out too because it's the Bone Rattler. It's probably meant specifically for Dry Bowser, which I have to be him. And then there's also Leaf Tires, if anybody wants to know the stats on it. It's exactly the same as, like, the roller kind of tires. And also, Button? Yeah, Button is the same. So it's all about the way things look. And also, green with pink. Pink? That's, that's purple. But yeah, green with purple work, looks pretty good. It's like, Eastery, delicious Wario-ness. I don't know. But the first one that I have to try first... Also, I want to point out for the... I just cannot speak right now. But I'd like to point out that I am on 100cc because still, 50cc for the DLCs... It's gonna be a bit too slow. Even 100 is a bit slow for my liking, but you know, you gotta have, keep it a little bit slow to enjoy the thing and just kinda see what there is to see. But yes, I'm gonna play the Crossing Cup first and then I'm gonna go over to the Bell Cup afterward. But, am I ready to start the Grand Prix? Yes! Or, okay. Are you ready? Oh, okay? I guess it still works, but, meh. I want a yes or no. Yes and or no questions. But also, uh, I just looked briefly right there, that apparently this is Baby Park. Which I am really happy about. Oh man. Wait, is that... Egg flying course in the background? I just love, like, Baby Park, I don't know if I really noticed too much before what was in the background, but... There's just so much amazingness! Oh, man! Also, this is completely, uh... Well, I don't know if it's completely, I need to check that. Are we gonna not be on anti-gravity for a bit? Or does this mean, basically, if you ram into anybody on the Baby Park, good things happen? Yeah, looks like it is. Okay. But yeah, this is, like, one of my favorite tracks from... Oh, why? I'm still uh, on the GameCube. Mario Kart Double Dash. Yes, you have to have a very brief pause. This is just such an amazing game. And also, this is just an amazing map because I used to play this a lot with just like some random people, and that's all they would ever want to play is just Baby Park. And for a very good reason, because it's like it's simple to get into, and also it's just insanity. It's good to already tell from here. I didn't think that I would be so far behind, but you know what? I'm gonna try to lap whoever this is. Oh no, 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 no. I think they added a little bit of, like, grass to the sides of this now. But that's the main thing that I always love, too. I just love lapping people. That's the main reason why I love Baby Park. Uh, it's not for, a, not for good reasons, but it's good reasons in my uh, honest opinion. Oh no! Because... Being a terrible person is the best kind of person to be. The way of Mario Kart. Oh no. <laughs> Did I? I don't even know what oh, th 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 happened. The music is just going insane now. Just listen to this. <laughs> what the heck? It just keeps speeding up and up, I, I guess, because of the fact that, you know, there's seven laps on Baby Park. Well, that wasn't too bad. And also, I think that this cart's not bad either. I don't know if I really like that it's... Because it is designated underneath the quad bike section. And quad bikes are usually not my favorites, but... Eh, it's not too bad. But it's just so beautiful. Look at all the things. And that roller coaster I wasn't even paying attention to, because I'm just like... I need to be paying the utmost attention to these two corners that we have. There are only two corners on Baby Park, but they are the most important two corners. Because that's still the only corners that there are. 
And you'd think that they would be important. I don't know. I know that I was spoiled that, like, people told me that Baby Park was coming back. Also, Cheese Land? I don't think I've ever played on this. But then again, I guess I didn't play on the Game Boy Advanced. I really need to get that Mario Kart. So I know that I think it has uh, Bowser's Castle 3 in that uh, Game Boy Advance as well, so... If it has that... Oh, Bowser's Castle 3. Oh, but this... This looks relatively like cheese, I guess. There's just stacks of cheese everywhere. I don't know if it really looked like this on the Game Boy Advance. That would be the most pixely cheese that I've ever seen. Oh, man. Also, I just know something now. Um... Look in the corner there, over to your right, that there is, like, the map on the screen now. I guess, I think that's actually an option that you get to choose, if you want to have the map on screen or not, and I guess it just is on by default now. Which is pretty good. Like, then, if I get to go on my, uh, Mario Kart, uh, I'm, I'm bad at aim aiming myself towards the right way to go. But then if I am playing Mario Kart Online again, then it's no problemo. I don't even need to take random pictures, because you can see how far ahead I am. And I can see how far I am, like, I need to go to be able to lap people. But still, you always gotta try to lap people. As much as you can. Also, I just noticed that now. Was there actually any coins on Baby Park? I wasn't paying attention to I don't know. But those toads... Oh, no! They are just sitting there, confused by their lack of eating of cheese. Oh no. Oh no. Which is what they need to be doing. Oh, and I think I know why that is the way it is! No! You're all going to die before me. But, like, why uh, the chain chomps go up in the air? It's because of the fact that there's oh, this is a little section where you parachute. Parachute off! world space jumping style. Oh, I'm gonna throw that behind me. I'm gonna take a chance because I need coins anyway if I even get them. Oh, okay. Maybe they changed the amount of times you actually get coins. So I mean they probably rebalanced the game while adding DLC and all these cool new features. Which are amazing. Specifically the cheese features. It's like I'm going right through Banjo-Tooie again. I have to go inside the stinky cheese, and then you, you get this a couple jiggies, and then you realize, what am I doing with my life? Oh, man. To this point where the cheese is just so smelly, that I can't breathe, and I'm... Ugh. Just so very terrifying. Okay. I think I might actually be able to do stunt jumps off of, like, the... I was gonna say perforations. It's not... Oh, yes, you can! You can do your tricks. That's awesome. Doing tricks off of cheese. Oh, man. That's actually, like, not that bad of a race. I like it. I don't know if it's gonna be one of my favorites, but... There are a lot of cheese jokes that I could potentially make, which I don't really have in my head right now. But in the future, I can make some very... cheesy jokes! Ah, uh, yeah, huh. That's, that's the only reason that I would have to be going on this race ever again, and I would choose it online. But you don't really get to choose in the same sort of way, so... You can still sort of choose it, though. Don't, don't judge. Don't judge. Don't judge the cheese before it's cooked to perfection and melty. But this is a new one. Crossing Cup Wild Woods. <laughs> yeah, that's the full name. It's not just Wild Woods, it's the Crossing Cup Wild Woods. But I like the looks of this. Are those... Is this, like, Shy Guy Pikmin land? That's what it seems like. The Shy Guy or Pikmin that are being controlled by the Toads. Ah, uh, Some conspiracy theories in action here. Because... The Toads are basically the ones that are the rulers of everyone. What the... Oh man, this just looks so awesome. If it doesn't have anything... Okay, this is definitely a Shy Guy place, because why else would he have, like, the symbol of his face there? I was considering this to actually just be a Donkey Kong, like... Maybe Donkey Kong has slaves, and they're known as... The Shy Guys now. Oh no. I guess... I thought that if I landed inside the water, then bad things would happen. 
so that's why I was trying to avoid it. But man, this, this though, this might be one of my favorite tracks from now on. This is awesome. So I know that like the Shy Guy, maybe just like everything dealing with Shy Guys, they like up and ups and downs. They, they do a lot of drugs, okay? But seriously though, because there's like Shy Guy Falls, which is like a vertical track, and then we're like going up the side of a tree in this. It's like, it's intense, and I think I just saw Pac-Man back there. Oh! I just like this section though. This is, this is just like Koopa Cape all over again. And Koopa Cape, if you don't like Koopa Cape, then I don't, I don't like you. I don't know. But also just like Dry Bowser. Ah, uh, he's just so good doing his tricks off the jumps, he just like breathes fire, which... I guess he must have some sort of like thing built inside of him to breathe fire properly. So I think that that other track might actually be faster, but like this one has coins. I think that's the one like trade-off from it. Well, I'm gonna switch. Oh, barrel! That was close. So very close. I could just like hold the banana in my hand. So I mean, I'm pretty far ahead. Well, actually not really. That baby Rosalina is just like, ooh, she's getting a bit too close to me. Gotta be careful, because or else then Dry Bowser could be getting arrested for doing stuff. Never trust anything. And there we go. Beautiful match and a beautiful finish by putting a banana right on the finish line. Yeah. I think I, I really like that match, other than the fact, like, I need to probably have better turning on uh, this the section where you just, like, go really fast on the water. Oh, man. Totally worth it. Totally worth it for that one. All this DLC, I mean, like, I, I don't even remember how much it costs for, like, the, getting the double pack, which I did before this second DLC came out. So, I mean, like, when I... When this DLC came out, it just started downloading on my console. I'm just like, oh, yeah, that's... Pretty good. But yeah, this is the main attraction. Animal Crossing. They were not very imaginative in their naming schemes, but you know. This is just like Animal Crossingville? Maybe that's what it is, because, you know, in Animal Crossing you always get to name your own city. And stuff like that. Well, it's, it's more of a town than a city, but... Ugh! Oh! And they even have, like, Animal Crossing music for it. Well, oh yeah, because I think I, like... I listened, watched, you know, all, all of the abubs. Yes, plural on that. But, there's like a video of just like, this is how we made the music for this. And it's just so beautiful. So they just had the guys with their like guitars and stuff, and they're just like, oh man. We're like the biggest Animal Crossing fans in the world. So much so that we're actually doing this for free. They didn't actually say anything of that, I'm just, I'm elaborating on what they probably would want to say. Oh! Oh man, it's Rossetti! <laughs> Instead of Monty the Mole, we have Rossetti the... I guess he's probably a mole too, but he's just... That terrible person that wants to murder you in your sleep because you just, like, press the power button off. And it happens. I'm sorry if I just, like... What if, what if the power goes off? Then, I mean, I can't help it if I didn't save. It just is a weird save system in the realms... of Animal Crossing. But yeah, like, I was gonna say that you, you name your own uh, little town, so I mean, like, I'm just, I'm gonna dub this Animal Crossingville. So I mean, at least that's well, not very imaginative of a, of a name, no. But it's a slightly more imaginative of a name with all the peach- Oh no! Mercedes coming back to kill me. Also, there was a peach on the ground there. I wonder. If I'm really far ahead on the last lap, I'm gonna try to, like, grab that peach. We're moving into the country, gonna eat a lot of peaches. Oh, maze, like, there is... I'm just gonna tell a mini story here, because, I mean... Although this is the fact that this is really beautiful and I can't not look at it. There's just little bunnies and stuff on the sides there. But... I'm amazed that, like, that song is actually... more well-known than I thought for the Peaches song, because of the fact that... You know... I was in a random bar, and they just started, like, the people that were doing live performances, they just started singing that. Oh, and Grissetti. Let's see. Peaches! Well, I think that was actually an orange, but it still gives you a boost. I approve. Because as we all know, 
oranges or like steroids. You eat an orange and then they're just like, okay, you've been doing oranges again. Oh. This is really calming music now. I love it. <laughs> just as Dry Bowser's flying through the air. <laughs> It's just like, yes, I'm going to rule the world while listening to the beautiful tunes. Oh man. I'm just going to assume that this is probably what plays in Animal Crossing around like... 2 o'clock in the afternoon. This is just like the song to be listening to. Oh man. I like it. New results. So I mean, I used to know like all the tunes, like still on the GameCube for the Animal Crossing. I think that was the first one in North America to be released of Animal Crossing, because I think there was an Animal Crossing on the N64 that was just like, this is Japan only. But, you know. Let's see this crazy highlight reel. Also, I just noticed I wasn't watching the highlights of any of those things. Whoopsie! So, I mean, I usually like to show the highlights. Just for the fact that... Is it only going to show the Animal Crossing highlights? Oh, okay. Well. Because, I mean, I like to see the map again in a different way. So, I mean, I'm a kind of a terrible person that I didn't watch them on that. I will 100% watch the highlights on the next one. Yeah. You have collected 2,400 coins. A new vehicle customization option has been unlocked. Why, thank you, random text, sir. But yeah, I three-starred it. Which, you know, wasn't too difficult, but 100cc is still... It's fairly casual, just nice, relaxing. And there's no, like, Mr. Red that's going to kill you, because he's in the little corner there. The bottom right corner, look at that thing! I think that might be something like the Red Raccoon Fox guy. Either that or it's Conker coming to kill us all in his way. Which, you know, he rips people's heads off, so... You gotta be wary of that.